Hello again folks, tonight's video is going to be a mystery, what have you been buying now type video. I've absolutely no idea what's inside this package so I thought we'd open it up and take a look together. But before I do that I'm going to do the prize draw for competition time number 9 and although there hasn't been one, competition time number 10. Um, if you recall last week I said I'd do a prize draw tonight and obviously that's what we're doing uh, but since then... Um, I've had an absolute explosion in the amount of people subscribing to my channel. Around 50 a day I've been getting, um, and indeed today I've had over 100. And from the usernames, it appears that the majority of subscribers today are from India. So thank you very much to all my Indian subscribers. Great to have you on board. Um, I won't go too deep into my analytics, but um, from the start of my channel, um, the top three have been, in terms of number of subscribers, UK at the top, then the USA, and then India. So thanks very much to each and every one of you, and of course to the rest of you around the world that are subscribing and watching my channel. So just to sort of take a step back, competition time nine was for 2,250 subscribers, and 10, which we're doing again tonight, is for 2,500 subscribers, and also... I'm pretty much on half a million views. Absolutely unbelievable. I never thought uh, my channel would get so much interest. I uh, really do appreciate you all uh, watching and subscribing and commenting and all that good stuff. Anyway, enough rambling on, as I often like to do. We'll go straight ahead and do the prize draw. So I'm going to do two prize draws uh, based on the comments from Competition Time 9. So, as always, we will paste the URL in, press go. Is it going to work? So, only 42 of you commented in the last video. Um, normally a lot more than that, it's a bit strange, but never mind, we'll click start. And pick our first winner. And the first winner is Dave Odessa. Uh, repairs and teardowns are always interesting. Maybe the odd MCU pick projects. Well, thank you very much, Dave. Yes, pick um, and microcontroller projects, stuff like that, is something I'm going to start doing. I've still got the really basic stuff to do. Um, I've still got the crumble to review. Uh, thanks to the guys over at Red Fern Electronics for sending me their starter kit. I haven't forgotten about you. I will do that shortly. So, yeah, uh, Dave will definitely be doing some of that. So, um, I'll do the next draw then. If I click go again, hopefully this will work. No, I might need to refresh. Bear with me. We'll paste that back in. Click go. And start again and pick a second winner. So again, good luck. Beatbot. Yeah, Beatbox Norwich. God, I was almost Beatbox in there. Um, keep doing what you do, Chris. It's a good channel. Well, thanks very much, Beatbox Norwich. So, Dave Odessa and Beatbox Norwich, if you would like to send me a message via my YouTube channel with your name and full postal address, I will get a little package sent out to you with some electronic goodies. Um, as always, just let me know what sort of level of electronics you're at and uh, I will get something appropriate sent out to you. Um, if you are from, say, India or abroad, it's probably going to be more cost effective for me to drop ship something to you from uh, a Chinese reseller. Um, Royal Mail here in the UK really um, are quite expensive when sending abroad, but I'll obviously get something out to you. Um, it just may take a couple of weeks, but um, yeah, please bear that in mind. Okie dokes, right, enough of that. Congratulations again. Um, let's do this unboxing. So it's come from a you sell. It does have some Chinese uh, text on it, so I'm not quite sure where it's come from. I've ordered quite a few bits, kits and that for uh, me to build on the channel. So it may be that, it may not be. Um, it is in a box though, and it doesn't sound very kit-like. So without further ado, let's uh, open it. Ah, so it's an ominous... Um, brown box and what does it say in the label company name Stoton GPS receiver GN 803G okay folks with a website there to download the drivers right I know exactly what this is and um, hopefully it's going to be a BU353 chipset at GLONASS GPS receiver and that's indeed what it is 
So it comes in a static shield bag. I don't want to say anti-static bag. Uh, one of these Ziploc ones. And there we have it. Um, it's what it is is basically a GPS receiver, um, a USB one. I've got plenty of GPS receivers with that, uh, you know, SMA and other types of connector, um, but I just wanted a GPS receiver that I could plug into a PC, a laptop, or a Raspberry Pi. Uh, I've had an idea for a little sort of GPS based um, clock uh, using Raspberry Pi. Um, and some matrix LEDs which I'm, I'm really interested in doing and I wanted to get this particular one because um, yeah it's got a, quite a strong magnet there as you can see um, because it uses that uh, 353 chipset now what uh, makes this GPS receiver differ from some of the older ones you can get is that this uses both the GPS constellation that's the American constellation of navigation uh, satellites and the GLONASS um, uh, constellation, which is a, a Russian uh, constellation of navigation satellites. If memory serves me right, it stands for... I had this off by heart because I did a project on it uh, for something. Um, Globe... What is it? Global Naya Navigazonia Sputnikovaya... Sistema, or something like that. Apologies for my pronunciation of uh, Russian, although it's probably like an English pronunciation of Russian, but never mind. It, essentially, it's the Global Navigation Satellite System, um, developed um, sort of mid-70s by the former Soviet Union, um, essentially to compete, I suppose, with the Americans, because remember, if you've seen some of my previous GPS uh, videos, um, the Russians, uh, sorry, the US um, developed the GPS system for military purposes. And of course, uh, the Russians would not have access to that, um, you know, capability. So they in turn developed a GLONASS system or constellation. So in a roundabout way, what I'm trying to say is this uses both constellations. So um, I can't remember how many satellites in each constellation, but you're essentially doubling or, you know, increasing uh, your chances of getting an accurate fix extremely quickly because of the additional uh, satellites orbiting the Earth. So, yeah, that's pretty much um, all this is. So I might um, have a play around with it and um, see how it performs and might do a further sort of review of it. Um, we ha do have screws there. I'm not going to tear it down tonight, but yeah, we might do that in a future video. But there we go. Uh, I just wanted to get that uh, competition time out of the way. Uh, so thanks again and congratulations again to Dave Odessa and Beatbox Norwich. Um, you are the two winners from competition time 9 and 10. Um, if the subscribers keep coming in as they are, I think I'm going to have to really uh, change the competition time frequency to every 500 subscribers initially. Um, even, you know, if I do that, if it, it continues at... 50 a day that's going to be every 10 days i'm going to be doing a competition time so um yeah i'll need to be selling the car and stuff if, if i don't cut it down slightly but of course you're still going to get a competition time at the same sort of intervals regardless of what i do so you're not going to lose out you're still going to have the same opportunity to win so i will call it a day at that once again thank you very much to each and every one of you for subscribing uh, regardless of where you reside in this big spinning ball of ours, uh, it's great to have you on board. Uh, great to have you, as I say, commenting and subscribing and, you know, having your inputs. Uh, I really, really do appreciate it. Uh, unbelievable. So, thank you very much. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Thumbs down if you didn't. If you haven't already done so and you'd like to do so and you'd like to become one of my subscribers, click on my, click on my fat head here. Um, and that's pretty much it. Um, as always, take care of yourselves and all the best.